In the intricate dance of a golf swing, should you initiate the movement with the hands, or should the genesis of the swing emanate from the ground up, an orchestrated rise that channels power from the very foundation of your stance? Consider the allure of beginning from the ground up, a symphony where the lower body orchestrates the initial notes. This approach, a nod to the biomechanics of a powerful swing, allows the legs to initiate the kinetic chain, transferring energy seamlessly through the torso and ultimately into the club head. It's a composition of efficiency and power, a controlled ascent that harmonizes the entire body's contribution to the swing. Contrast this with the notion of starting with the hands, a temptation that might seem intuitive but risk dissonance in the golfing symphony. The danger lies in the potential for an uncoordinated surge of power, a discordant note that disrupts the natural flow of the swing. So as you stand over the ball, contemplating the start of your swing, the preference should lean toward a ground-up approach. Let the legs lay foundation, the rhythm emanating from the very earth beneath you. In this golfing sonata, may the ascendancy from the ground be the melody that carries your swing to the crescendo of a well-executed shot.